Hi everyone, uh, welcome to the training, Cody training to accelerate um, porting your application codes to GPU codes today in an expert level. My name is Helen He, I am with NERSC User Engagement Group. A quick introduction, uh, the tool is called Cody, previously known as uh, Parallel Aware Analyzer. It is a uh, programming in de development tool for C, C++ and Fortran codes for uh, multi-core multi CPU or GPU using OpenMP and OpenACC. One of the big advantage of the tool is that it can automatically insert OpenMP or OpenACC directives in codes. So for beginner users, as a big um, advantage. It also can produce performance optimization report with some recommended actions. Um, Cody has a rich uh, catalog of op performance optimization best practices, uh, the link here. And uh, we will talk about some of these practices today as well. And the training today is um, emphasized and more hands-on and demo train. So we have a very rich collection of demos and step-by-step -step guides for select benchmarks and real scientific application codes that you can follow thanks to our um, trainers today, Manuel Ar Arnaz and Ulysses Costi, Fanny Garcia. They are actually located in Spain and they're the founder uh, the company of Cody. <laughs> So uh, we really appreciate that provide this thorough training and uh, worked with us to develop uh, the guides and uh, with all listen to our recommendations. So really appreciate their work and hope you can get lots of uh, good practice out of this today and learn the tool and, and be useful for your applications. Day two. So day one and day two, we have three and a half hours each day will be demos and hands-on interleaved, plus Q&A and some break. And you can see a list of applications here. Some of them we will also assign you as homework. More um, best basic codes today and more uh, more advanced codes tomorrow. And even with, you know, um, a thought process behind optimized application, real application codes and Fortran codes and the vectorization, multi-threading for tomorrow. And you're welcome to bring your own codes uh, for uh, get a start uh, on porting them to GPU as well. Uh, quick logistics, everyone is muted and uh, please change your name to first name and last name. You can click on the participants and then more next to your name to rename it. And we have enabled captions and view for transcripts. You can toggle on, on and off. You can even save uh, transcripts if you like. We'll be using Q&A Google Doc. I've put the link in the Zoom chat. I'll put it again. Also, you can find this um, slide deck already uploaded to the event webpage. So you can find the link there as well. And um, videos will be posted after this training will take a, a few days because we need to trim and, and split and process. We will also um, off, uh, <clears throat> also uh, order professional captions afterwards as well, but we'll put the original link uh, with Zoom or with uh, uh, YouTube captions first and then up, update with uh, professional captions later. We also consider possibility of um, Cody appointments for uh, nurse office hours. And we also prepared uh, a survey. Uh, appreciate you could do it for us for improvement future for the future. Everyone is added to the N-Train 8 projects. If you're a nurse user, you're added to it. And if not, we have sent you a link to apply for a training account, which is also in this project. The purpose is that, that you can access the reservations for today uh, on Cody Day 1 CPU or Cody Day 1 GPU for today. So you need to add to these two um, flags for your sbatch command uh, or your uh, scripts. We have, uh, we have sample scripts in the examples directory, but then just update with these two flags. And outside of training hours, use your own project uh, without the reservation flag. You can SSH to parameter p onenersc and then CD to your scratch directory, then copy over the um, the whole directory of the uh, example codes to your own directory. There's a dot at the end, don't forget that. A quick parameter documentation right here. 
And to use Kodi, module load Kodi, and the newer version, default version is 2023.1. It's commands, um, PW report, PW directed, PW loops with different options and use dash dash help to find help menu. There are also documentation example codes in the installation directory, download Kodi DIR. Just to mention that you can use logging node for most of the development work for GPU for the Kodi commands. And you will be choosing um, different compilers. Most likely, you'll be choosing GCC. So you can use um, the the <coughs> Kodi supported compilers, which means you can use uh, choose those compilers and then run the PW report these commands. And afterwards, after generated codes, uh, optimized GC or uh, OpenMP or OpenACC uh, in directive inserted codes, then you can choose any compiler supported on um, parameter such as uh, and the NVIDIA. NVIDIA support is not supported by Kodi, but NVIDIA, you can use NVIDIA compiler to compile the Kodi generated codes. And then you will just submit batch jobs to run um, on <clears throat> CPU or GPU with OpenMP or OpenFCC um, parameter. So this is all I have today. And I'll turn it over to Manuel uh, for the introduction of Kodi and the schedule of the day. Thank you.